Hey, what's up, guys? It's Slim here. Welcome back to the channel. Man. Thank you guys for joining me once again on this beautiful Wednesday. In today's video, I'm going to be talking about the absolute blender I've just gone through in the past 28 hours now. Honestly, this whole entire week, I've been just completely fucked over with. So I'm going to talk about how I basically lost my job, school and all that stuff, and how yesterday, when I wanted to stream or wanted to record, my PC completely fucked on me, okay? And a little bit of like some little mini rants about the Call of Duty community. And if you guys haven't yet and you're new to the channel, make sure you guys drop a like and subscribe. We post daily Call of Duty videos and join my Discord server down below. But let's get right into the nitty gritty. We have my face came on because I'm, I'm just obviously pissed off, okay? Like, this has gotten me so mad that I had to turn on my face cam for this video, okay? So over the weekend, I went to my job, right? Just to, like, check up on them. And also, I got a new iPhone, I, the iPhone 15. Shout out to my dad. I needed to get a charger for it because, like, it doesn't come with the button, all that stuff. And I thought my discount would work, which it's a pretty good discount. But I found out that my discount doesn't work because they disabled my account and everything with it. So I asked my manager, who was there, and he said, I have to reapply and look for hours because I'm technically seasonal. Like, you know, my part-time position, go. Like, I, I literally forfeited it, basically, right? which I understand. But a month ago, they told me that I would still have my job that I could come back to the summer and work the days that I wanted and the hours I wanted, which was going to be about 28 hours, three days, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. So I don't miss my wrestling. I can still upload. I still have the weekend and all that stuff because back then for my first semester in the fall, of 2023, I did horrible. I, I just couldn't do work on the weekends and then going to school five times a week. I couldn't do that. And now I'm basically out of a job. Like I can still go back there, right? I'm still employed there technically, but like, like I, I it's just not guaranteed hours and all that stuff, which that sucks. And I'm like, dude, I don't know what to do. And I'm just stressed out about that. School just ended for me yesterday on Tuesday was my last day. I had my final. I don't think I did that well. And like, I'm just literally freaking the fuck out. Like, and it's the one class that I'm doing bad in, and it just sucks because the whole the whole situation for school was just effed up for me, man. Freaking start of the semester, I found out my GPA is way too low, right? I was in probation, and that's because and that's all because I didn't want to retake all my classes from my fall semester and graduate late. So I just took the bad grades. Then I still had to finish one class from the fall, burying all my spring classes. And at the time, I was going to school at 11 a.m. And then staying until about 7 p.m., right? So I was doing that. I passed that one class. Like I ended up with a B, right? Because I clutched up all the final. Then I just lost track with the one class I did bad in. That was another math class. And I just lost complete track of it. It was just so hard to go back. I tried so many things from just better note taking, better studying, but the tutoring, just nothing worked. Like I, I just couldn't get into a groove for that class. So just to explain it all, I was taking six classes for about a month and a half. Right, one class that I did not finish in the fall that she allowed me more time on. Then I had a short class that was only eight weeks. I passed with a hundred on that. Right, then the four other classes that I had, right, one of them I, I did bad in, which was the other math class. Right, the other three, 97, 85, 87. So I have good grades. Like I was like locked in and dialed in for all my other classes, except for that other math class that I took this semester technically and just the final was super stressful i used up all my time and she even gave me like an extra 10 minutes it's just like yeah like you know you're like i was the last one there dude like it was bad dude but like i just feel like a complete idiot in school dude like i don't, I don't think i like i'm built out for it but like dude like i went from like a 1.6 and i think i'm gonna go to about a 3.1 3.0 something like that because of my grades which is crazy but you know like i had to come back of the century for school bro because if i didn't pass any of my classes or i didn't get over a 2.0 dude i would have gotten kicked out of the university right and I'm, it's not even me being a dumbass it's literally just because you know, i got into a car accident missed two to three weeks of school it just never recovered right now look where i'm at five months later right freaking finished my first year my gpa is the best it's ever been my grades have been the best Except for one class and freaking this whole entire semester, I was basically doing six classes, waking up early, staying there till seven, driving back an hour. Like it, it's just insane what I did this semester. Like I'm proud of myself, but I really just wish I just had that cherry on top with, with this last class that I took on yesterday. Um, Hopefully I passed. Hopefully <laughs> I don't want to retake the class because it makes no sense. It's called discrete math and it just has no numbers involved. It's literally just a bunch of letters and formulas that you don't understand. It's so stressful. Then yesterday when I wanted to stream, I've been streaming on YouTube now whenever I can, whenever I want to. I got completely fucked by my PC. So about a week ago, I literally updated Windows for the first time in about a month and a half. It was just one thing that I had to download an update. That one update that I had reset all my power management settings. 
So literally all my USB devices for my camera, my microphone, my keyboard and mouse, my controller, everything got put on power save mode. So if I was streaming and playing, it would prioritize OBS first and turn off all my devices until OBS caught up or had more, you know, enough power to run at whatever settings I told it. So that fucked me last night. I couldn't play or figure out anything for about three and a half hours. And when I did want to play, the servers on Steam got maintenance for about 30 minutes, I believe. So last night when I was going for my zombies camel grind, Steam servers did maintenance for 30 minutes. I had these U USB disconnecting issues of the power save settings and all that stuff. And I just wasn't having a fun time. I wasn't doing good. I kept getting completely fucked. I either lagged out, I think the third time, and or my pr Steam profile was signed out of, which makes no sense. I don't know why that happens, right? That was happening all last night. Freaking, you know, everything just, this whole entire week has just been kicking my ass, dude. Like, I know, I, 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 and, and, you know, like, I just, I just, I had to vent it out this video because, dude, like, I, I'm not going to therapy anymore. I'm not fucking going to shout out Mr. Rice anymore at my high school, who was literally, like, my father figure. I literally just needed to, like, vent <laughs> on video, bro, because, dude, like, I'm gonna be honest with you guys, like, I wanna make this my full-time thing. I don't wanna do anything else. I don't want, like, I don't wanna be in an office job that I'm not gonna, like, and just rot my life away, dude. Like, that's not, I know I could do so much more with my life than just work in an office job, and, like, dude, like, I'm, I'm trying my hardest to make this thing work out, like, dude, I mean, it's working out, but, like, dude, like, I just wanna keep going. I wanna make this my full-time thing, and, like, and I'm gonna pull the curtain back a lot here. In three years, in the last three years now, because in about, I think, during the summer, it's going to be three years for me. So about three years now, the past two and a half months have been the best months of my career. In three years, I've had my best months on YouTube, on TikTok. It's been absolutely insane. All my numbers have gone up. So what I'm basically saying, like all my numbers have gone up by 100% or more because on YouTube, they say like 299%, 1000%. On TikTok, it's been absolutely insane. On YouTube, it's been absolutely insane. And like, I'm just like so grateful, right? But like, I just... I, I don't know. I'm trying I'm trying my hardest myself from not burning out. I'm not saying I'm burnt out, but like, dude, like I I'm just impressed throughout the last five months. For a month and a half of that five months, I was taking six classes basically. Staying to school for literally multiple hours with huge breaks in between and just like forcing myself to do schoolwork. I did so well in school. I just couldn't end it well. Freaking I'm out of a job right now and I don't know what my, you know, my sister is, my my dad's gonna say. Um, you know, because like I, I, I'm a very private person when it comes to like, um, not what I do, but like, you know, how much I'm making and stuff. Cause I've been fucked over in the past. This whole PC issue thing, I spent $5,000 on a PC and it just, it just gets fucked over by windows. But literally like the only thing that's really up for me right now is like my mental health and my physical health, the videos and all that stuff. And like, I try not to tie my emotions to the, to like how good like i'm doing on youtube which i i rarely do but like when i've seen the biggest amount of success that i've ever seen in my three years of doing youtube it just makes me happy <laughs> and like the purpose of this video is just to like really just like vent out my feelings to you guys maybe get advice from you guys because a lot of you guys are a lot older than me uh i still have some younger audience but a lot of people are either my age and or older by a couple years and like they've definitely experienced more things to me so like any advice would really be appreciated man but literally the entire support throughout the past two and a half months has been insane. It's just, it's constantly gone up. But the support recently for the past two and a half months, since I really started taking it seriously again, has just been absolutely insane. March, you know, coming back, that was like my month coming back and actually doing this like 110%. It was good. April, way better. This month already, eight days into the month, the best I've ever done in three years, bro. And I'm just gonna keep going, man, because there's no reason to stop. I don't have a job. I don't have school anymore. I enjoyed it. And this is something that I enjoy to do, something I love to do. And like, hopefully it just works out within the next couple of years, man, because dude, even though I've worked on it for three years already, and like some people have done it in three years where they became full time, like dude, like as long as I get there, I don't care how long it takes, but yeah, thank you guys for all the love and support. Thank you guys for watching this video and letting me vent. Give me any advice, man, on the job, school, PC, get better at <laughs> IT and shit. But yeah, it's been your boy, Limbo, guys, peace.